What is good, everybody? We are back again. This is our second try on this statue. Uh, I bought this for my lovely wife back in, what, January? Yeah. And um, we got it home. We were getting ready to film the video. And we found a couple broken pieces. So we ended up having to bring it back. The store is now going out of business. And we picked this up for how much? $100. Yep, $100. I personally think this thing's amazing. She has wanted it for a while. Um, you know, you guys will be the judge of what you think. This is a tweeter head. As you see, it is a quarter, or, um, not quarter size, one six scale. Um, how many was it? I think 800. I, I would have to look at the box again. Let's not quote me on how many. But this piece was something she really wanted. Wait till you see the next thing that will be coming out. She got another thing for half off. Uh, Prime 1 statue. I'm not going to break it down yet until you see it. But we're going to run through this together. Family style here. So. Here's the statue. Um, let's see. Let's measure this out. So from base to head... About 16 and a half inches. So, base to head, about 16 and a half. And just him is about 14 inches. So, he's a little bigger than uh, normal six scale, but looks great. It's got a great weight to it. It is not a light piece for how um, small it is. The base is really nice. Um, what do you think about the base? I like it. So, I'll show you guys right now the base. Let's... Let's see, this this was a selling point for us. We actually uh, want to get both the Harley Quinn and this one. So now we're looking for the Harley. But as you see, that base... Kind of reminds me of Masonic. So kind of exactly, reality. duality right there. Black and white. you got the Joker's cards. His big old mallet. Tons of detail on that mallet. Back here, so the spots that were broken on this... Um, this right here, this valve was broken, glued it, it's looking good, and this card fell out. Other than that, everything else is pretty well good. That base is really, really killer. Uh, let's see if we get a really good shot of that base for you guys. Look at that. It just looks great. And now... Looking at that green, it is that um, see-through-ish um, sculpt, but that green pops. I hope it's coming through. We are recording this in 4K. This is our first time in a while doing 4K. Really hope this looks good. But all those cards in there. You got a Robin strapped to, and that right there is where the brake is. Like I said, you can't really see it. All right, let's see if I can get a good shot of that mallet for you guys. There you go. Look at that thing. I personally love the mallet. That was one of my favorite parts. What do you think? You like that mallet a lot? Yeah. Look at those teeth. The detail in that mallet is amazing. I'm telling you guys, if you guys like statues and you haven't got this one yet, and you can find it for a good price... Definitely get it. There he is. The legend. So, all in all, um, the colors really pop. The statue really looks good to us. Um, what's your favorite aspect of the statue right now? I like all the bright colors. What do you think, though? Do you think um, they went right with doing the, the cards? Yeah. As the base, you know, the cards and everything. Mm -hmm. So, right there, that's what the cards look like up nice and close. Really, this thing, you know, of course, all statues have their flaws, but this one, for the price, I don't see any major flaws. And I just love his face in this. I really do. Here 
right there, yeah. So you can see the cards and that face, perfect. So, I don't know what you guys are thinking. I really want you guys to tell me down in the comments if you would purchase this statue. Number one, if you would purchase it at the retail price, which is 300 or if uh, you, like us, and found it for $100, what would you have done? Um, even though, like I said, this was broken, um, would you have picked it up for $100 with a little, you know, break? So, any questions about it, you guys definitely can hit us up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you check out Tossing Toys every chance you get. We're growing every day. And we have a special, like, my woman has wanted this statue that we're going to be showing you next for almost a full year. It is by XM. No, no, Prime. Sorry, it's a Prime 1 statue. We did pick it up for half off. So, it, literally, the guy might as well rob robbed me because I was that excited to get my wallet out. I hadn't been that happy to throw money at somebody in years. So, let me know what you think about this. I give it a, a 8 out of 10. What do you say? I give it a 9. I like it. So, on the Tossin' Toy scale, we're averaging now in an 8.5. That is a killer freaking statue. And the base isn't huge, so you can fit it anywhere in your place. Let me know if you have this, want it, or will be getting it. Thank you, everybody. Nothing but love out there. And peace. Bye.